Hello everybody, my name is Jackson, the new Raw General Manager and the current United States Champion. This is the first episode of the brand new era of Monday Night Raw. I'm with my commentary partner, my buddy Daniel. How are you doing today for the first oh, new era? Well, I'm doing fantastic. Um, it's good to be on Monday Night Raw. I uh, can't wait for New York, New Jersey. Let's get this on the way because Jackson, I believe you've got a promo for us. Well, ladies and gentlemen, Ma Jackson is about to make his way to the ring, and I can't wait to see what he has to say. And this is going to be very interesting because, well, I mean, I don't know what he's got. This is what he has to say, and oh, great, he's bringing his United States Championship out here as well. Uh, of course, he is. Your GM is here! Yeah, your general manager is here. He won that match last week. The following contest is scheduled uh, for Jackson, the United States Making champion, will be in action a class of champions. He'll be facing his uh, friend Jack and uh, one half of the Holy Alliance. United, United States, States champion, champion Raw General Manager. Jackson. And now when usually when promos go, he keeps his jacket on, but tonight he said he was going to take his jacket off because he's got some business to take care of. And I uh, hope that at the end of the promo, uh, I couldn't come sooner rather than later. In fact, I feel like the end of the days of this promo, well, Let's just say the end of this promo could come right about now. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm your new GM, your new United States Champion after last week. Now I run this show. I hear a lot of people saying on the internet, oh, it's over, but the thing is, there's gonna go, there's gonna come a time where you think everything is lost and has ended. But the truth is, Everything has just begun, it has just been found. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Jackson, and welcome to the new era of Monday Night Raw. Oh, wait a minute! Jackson was in the middle of the doing a promo, and he just said, oh, oh no, wait a minute, the rock! It's just, oh my god, the rock! What the hell are you doing out here? Interrupting me, your GM. Oh my god, no! Wait a damn minute! The Rock is out you here! Think just because you're world champion, you can interrupt me? Oh no! What the hell is The Rock doing out here? Now, The Rock walked into the ring with this championship. Uh oh. I have a bad feeling about this. And the rock. What do you want? <clears throat> You're gonna speak. Finally, the rock has come back. <clears throat> no, the rock says that I'm going to come out here, and I have just like to ask, who in the blue how? Do you think you are? I'm your GM. It doesn't I'm matter who you are. Or shut! I'm gonna kick your ass if you don't get out of my ring. Your ring? This isn't your ring. This is. I'm your GM, Charles and ring. I'm the United States champion. Get out of here. Listen, the Rock says this. Just you wait until the millions and millions of the Rock's fans start chanting the Rock's name as he wants to kick your candy ass all over New Jersey. I'm, I have a question for you, Rock. What are you doing out here? No, the Rock says this. It doesn't matter what you're doing out here. Oh, the, the, the Rock's gonna give you a ass kicking of the last time. Because, really? yeah, really, because I know you miss, you like to mistreat general managers, you like to mistreat everyone else in that back locker room. Well, 
The I'm the says, locker room leader. I'm the locker room leader. I run this show. The only thing that you're me. gonna be running from is my ass. Uh, the only thing you're gonna be running is running away from my ass, my boot, from your ass. I'm gonna ask you one. Take your WWE title and you can shove it up your ass. Get hit with the stunner by Stone Cold because you're his bitch and leave my ring. And what if and what if I refuse? Oh really, you're gonna refuse to your GM? How do you like damn apples? You're gonna refuse on me? Hell no! No one refuses to me. No one doesn't listen to my orders. No, no one, nobody. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. I want, and the rock says this. I want to be. I want Edge tonight, because I am standing up for Titus O'Neil. So give me. What a goddamn match, you little You want Brony. you want in the handicap match? Yes. You know what you want? Yes I do. You're on And well the Get away from me! Well the Rock has gotten what he wanted and Jackson is not happy about it. And he got back in the ring and went toe to toe with the rock and into his face. And well, Keelan needed to be restrained here. Oh man, Jackson has made some enemies on my universe, no doubt for sure. And well, later on tonight, he will be in action, Jackson, but well, up next, <laughs> all I had to say is a thank you, Jackson. And I, I hope, I'm glad that there's no microphone on you because otherwise I'll be telling you to shoo, shoo, please. Because up next, we've got Alpha Academy, Otis, and the Master, Chad Gable, versus Ezekiel and Elias. Man, this is going to be one hell of a matchup. I can't wait for that. And that match is next. Well, welcome back, folks. And uh, Hey, wait, wait, match. Jackson! A shoosh! Shut the hell up. Because the Academy has arrived to set back to the front row, and here comes the Academy. Yes, so Alpha Academy is generally making their way to the ring. Shush, Daniel! Shush, please! Thank you! Excuse me? But in a serious note, uh, I like what you've done here for tonight's big matchup. As the big man Otis and uh, of course, Ready, Willen, and Gable, um, the Alpha Academy, and Chuck Gable. What, let me ask you, what do you make of these two guys right here? Listen, I am the back of the locker room. Otis and Chad Gable, basically, I don't ever understand how to put Gable in the show. And the license he came up to me and said, Did you hear about these guys? And I'm like, No, but you can take care of them if you want. Well, you know what? As a matter of fact, I said to them, I'll make the match for you guys so they can shut the hell up themselves. Well, and here comes Ezekiel. It's the younger brother of Elias. And, uh. I got you gotta expect that there's going to be a concert. Pretty damn soon. But and their opponents first from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, weighing in at 222. Well, I'm glad, I'm glad to, again, I've got to apologize. I was really bashing uh, Elias and no, the younger brother. I have a question for you, Daniel. We all know that you love to walk with Elias, but can I be one of your speak? I'd like to say, I don't want to hear him speak. I do want to see him fight, though. I want to see what this guy is made of. He already beat. He's Elias. Zeke the Freak. Zeke the Freak. Zeke the Freak. You damn right. And I can tell you, I think Ezekiel, the younger brother of Elias, 
I'm thinking with Elias, you know, going, he said, he said like, I buffed it up a little bit, I want to try and tone my body back the way it was. Oh, wait a minute, here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, Ladies and gentlemen Elias. Elias. Oh, speaking of Amen, we're about to hear the song. No, brother, one of my favorite songs in WWE history. How many times are gonna kill? Oh, yes, you Trying to put me in the grave. Yeah. Cause I'm telling you, I'm about a six feet. I need someone to stay. Okay, no, I think it's about time you shoot. That is not what yes. I was. <laughs> Let's concentrate on this, my friend. Let's concentrate on this. Well, coming up next is Ty. <laughs> Then the master Trent Gable with his true trunk go to the Alpha Academy taking on the Lyos and his one of the deputies. Okay, the Raw. Why? Oh, what? Come on. That's a, how many times did this referee get knocked That out? is not how we act. That is not. Oh man, what the hell? What the hell, Chad Gable? You're meant to be the master, the strategist. You're supposed to be the number one guy of the academy. Well, I'm going to, so I'd like to say with the uh, Clash of Champions coming very, very close, and the Ustos are defending their titles uh, against the well, well, Bree Zongo from the Raw Tag Team Champions uh, title, Bree and Fandango in an Uso Panic Temporary Tables match, where it's the first person to knock out your opponent. They have to be watching, both Breezango and the Usos have to be watching closely because who knows, maybe the both Elias and Ezekiel and the Alpha Academy are going to be, you know, maybe hoping to get a future title shot, don't you think, Jackson? Yeah. I'm not going to check the bias and we'll see the two more time here. Great brothers, bad. Being in a tag team for the same time, I think they're yeah, uh, someone will come over here and fix Jackson's microphone because I already heard every other word that you said there. Uh, so, but, so, can you hear me now? I can hear you now, nice and clear. Uh, All right. But Chad well, as I was saying, the Academy is a great tag team, and I feel like they could walk up to the point of getting a pack and bottom up against the USO Zebu Zangle, who have a lot of other Clash of Champions with the Unified Tag Titles. Indeed, we all find out. Will, will we be walking with Elias and speaking with Zeke? Or oh, amongst the Chad Gable? Oh my god, good grief! Throw it across the ring by Zeke. Jeez. And a face on it right into the map. And here comes Elias, Ezekiel's older brother. Oh man. Hey, man. Second. He made indeed, and win him at Chad Gable, and oof! Oh man, oh there's a back elbow, folks, a back elbow. Nice, nice, nice back elbow, folks, and wait a minute, monkey flew! Oh my goodness. I mean, you've got a matchup coming up, uh, Jackson, it's a steel cage match, as you and Jack are going to be taking on Grimm. Yes, and... and it doesn't matter when you ask me the question how great is the Alpha Academy or who's like who think the who's goes over some possible help for these two tag teams. Listen, the Box of the of Champions with the unified tag team titles. It doesn't matter because me and Jack are gonna get the first opportunity because if if there's if there's the tag the tag, because the only number one tag team of WWE, it's the Envoy Alliance, the United States Champion and the Intercontinental Champion, and yes, we have a class of champions, beautiful push match, but that's going to be a match out of respect, of honor, for the floor, the honor, and the sacredness of this. Oh, 
Oh my, what is that? The power of Otis! Good God! Otis, oh my goodness. And obviously, as you let me on your GWA show, I was able to get into the Warzone match. FAFW. Uh, FAFW, sorry. CWA is for Cruiserweights, even though technically you are a Cruiserweight, and you would be allowed on that show. But you are the general manager of the <laughs> You know I'm in FAFW. Yes. But, uh, going on for this universe now on Money Act Raw, this is actually a back and forth type of matchup. Uh, um, you know, that's a great strategy as a tag team getting those frequent tags in and out of the match. Indeed. <coughs> Indeed. And look at this, Elias was taken down with a almost like a four-way slam, I think that was like a T-bone suplex and Rashad Gable defeating Drew Gulak on CWA this past week. Oh, there's a back out, oh, Elias with a nice kick to the ribs and now, oh, wait a minute, Elias oh, walk, walk it up into the corner. Into his corner, and now... And oh boom. my god! What a brutal force from Elias! Oh, wait a minute here. What's oh, he gonna no. do? Not again. Yeah, it's twice in a row, but into the corner. Chad Gable just stop on a muffle with John. He's getting the shit stomped right out of him. Yeah. Oh, kick to the lower back. Run to the kidney area. And now, wait a minute. Going for it. Oh, well, what a reversal! What a moving oh, like God. What an incredible. Yeah. Yeah, you got the yeah, that was an amazing maneuver. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Uh, Chad Gable, he beat oh. through Gulak with this move. The Gable. rolling suit, John. Oh, the suit was one, man. two. I know Ezekiel breaks up the pin. Oh wait, Chad, Chad Gable trying to get to Ezekiel. I'm presuming. I don't know. Well, was lost. Oh, oh my god. body and Elias has been taken down. Oh, oh, is there a tree trunk of Otis? Uh -oh. Finally Otis in this map. The tree trunk, the number one guy to Chad Gable. Huh? Well, it's a match snap. Oh, oh, now here comes it's Elias. Right to left, right to left, my god! He does not, he, he does not care. No, he doesn't, he is throwing it, but, uh, oh, Otis! Take it, oh, well, no. Now, we have our cabinet, okay. One, two, one. Oh, wait a minute, look at this now, wait a minute, from behind! He gets rid of Ezekiel, oh, he takes it down with an elbow drop, and then Otis! Oh my god, the whole hell's broken loose! The Academy, Elias, Ezekiel, the family, the Academy, unloading in this ring and all over the arena, they just don't kill. No man, right to the hands, close fist, that is an illegal maneuver right there. That's still a human being, damn it. Uh oh, wait a minute, going for oh. the... Oh! away! That is not going to drift away, that's a swinging neck breaker. Oh, and if somebody's oh, been busted up, and then... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. But someone was busted open as Elias. Oh my god, come on, Riff! Get a hold of this matchup! They don't care. They, they, they don't, don't care, I tell you. Uh oh. Oh man, the power of big. Oh, the gorilla press slam! My this goodness. It's got to be over. It's got to be. Oh, going for the pin off that gorilla press slam. Uh, one, two, oh my god! <laughs> what just happened? I had no idea. And what Zekiel, just happened there? Oh my I, goodness. Oh my god, and there it is! The world's strongest slam onto Ezekiel. And now Elias is in trouble. Oh, wait god, a minute. Like, looks at this. Oh, I went from the back elbow. Ezekiel's been taken out. Jackson. Oh, there's a right hand. Uh oh! Oh no! Big no. boy going up! No. No. Oh my god, it knees! <laughs> Elias almost became a pancake and 
Once again. Oh, the rolling cutter. Oh, that's his rolling cutter. They drift away. One, One two, two, three. They're going to the ZQ will pick up the victory. That was awesome. Here are your winners. And I want will bust it open. Oh, man. The brothers with the win over the Academy good win tonight. That Congrats. was awesome. But, yeah. Jackson. me and my best friend, yes. Jack, have a match. Against Connor and Dominic Dovanovic. But, before that, we're going to take a quick commercial break. Because my, my food that I ordered just arrived. So we'll see you after the commercial break. Welcome back ladies and gentlemen into Monday Night Raw and here comes Dominic Tarakovic as he's going to be teaming up with Grim or Connor, whatever you like to call him now, but Connor and uh, Dominic Tarakovic. So they're going to be taking on the unholy alliance of the Intercontinental Champion Jack and the United States Champion and Raw General Manager Jackson. The following now, contest with inside the steel cage, cage. Connor knows what it's like to be inside the steel cage. He, well, he beats, weighing in at uh, 200. He beats Damian Priest in the steel cage match that turned into like a uh, three stages of hell match. And he's been inside the hell in the cell, and Jackson's been inside the elimination chamber, and a steel cage match himself against Connor himself. So this is going to be very interesting. I don't know why Jackson made this match, but I think it has to do with what happened a few weeks ago on Monday Night Raw. But this rivalry with Titus O'Neil and Dominic Davidovic with the Unholy Alliance is unreal. And I still, yeah, on FAFW it was on my other universe mode. Connor was a being respected by Jackson and of course you know it's very from Detroit, Michigan weighing in at 250 but pounds but we've had to find Connor. out because Connor is making his way to the ring and the this tag team matchup now I, <laughs> I generally I'm still starting to get a little bit concerned. Like the attitude, uh, Connor's uh, attitude, and ever since coming out to saying, "Hey, his name is Grim now," he's been speaking to the Judgment Day over the last few weeks about knowing that they said to him that there's a fourth member of the Judgment Day. And, uh, Of course, you know, the Judgment Day are in action next. So we've had two matches already, including this one. No, no. And here comes Jackson and, and Jack, the Unholy Alliance. The, uh, now, whether they are going to get along, and well, we shall see. In a Connell Champion Jack, the United States Champion Jackson, the On Holy Alliance. And at a combined weight of 420. They will be pounds. going one on one with each other. For the, undi the undisputed US Anaconda Championship. Because so obviously there's gonna be brand new championship going be revealed. And well, Jackson, Jack, I, they've been on the My Universe mode for quite some time, and finally, finally, I've won the biggest, the mid, the one of the two of the biggest prizes in WWE history, and that is the Intercontinental Championship and the United States Championship, and at Clash of Champions, two, uh. Friends, I'm gonna go with each other in a friendly competition. Well, 
here we go, folks. Steel cage match. Connor and Dominic versus Jackson and Jacket. Look at this. Here we go. Nick Jackson and Connor going to get some other back break up. I wonder if Connor already trying to climb. Oh, Jackson. you don't. Uh -oh. Oh, no, Jackson. you don't. No, you don't. And well, well, it looks like um, don't know. Don't know what is going to happen. I uh, know. Oh no, you don't, Connor. Oh, that's a. It took a long time to hit that time. Uh, running center, but it's. I don't know. Code breaker. And ah, crucifix power bomb. No one had Jackson trying to escape. Uh, Jack is taking care of Dominic to the curvage. And now look at this. But remember, we have both members of the team had to exit the cage. Now, wait a minute. Where do you escape here? No, but, uh, wait a minute. It goes Connor. Connor, this is his elemental. This is his elemental. Oh, no. Uh oh. Oh, I don't like the looks of this. Meanwhile, Dominic. Showing off the power! Oh no! Look out now! Oh no! And a springboard back! Suplex by Jack! And now on the second rope here! No son of versus! But meanwhile! Look on the top of the screen! Got Jackson and, and Connor! But going at it as a wicked clothesline! There goes Jackson! And now maybe... Nice, looks his footing, but now Connor is going to be the one to climb. Oh, but no, Jackson's there. Oh, wait a minute. Shows that. Backbreaker. No, wait a minute. Tom, minute, Tom, McCoy, that's trying to climb himself. Double X, and nobody misses. Oh, man. But wait a minute, oh no, Jack's there. He stops Dominic and the will now with a backbreaker. Oh, wait a minute here. Oh, that hands up, Jim, for a bunch of Oh my god, the passion that these two teams have been actually. Oh, wait a minute, I feel like this change man has lasted longer than some of the other cage matches and there's a face buster. Up to Jackson by like that. Oh, there's a shot to the arm. Dominic down the cut, literally is taken down as Connor is there all oh, alone and left in the ring, but he stops Jack from climbing. He stops him from climbing. This is a temporarily! And now Connor is the one climbing the cage. And now wait a minute, Dominic prevents him from getting to his part his uh oh tag team partner. Now wait a minute. Uh, Screw loose off! Oh wow, what a new move that red! Oh, there's a lion saw by Dominic! That's a Jackson, but now Jack! He's the one climbing! Don't think... Can Dominic get round him? I think... Oh, wait a minute! That is smart from Jackson! Oh, but never mind, it's full corrected! Oh... Oh, the JKO! But Connor... It's there! Can... Oh, is he gonna get there? Is he gonna get there? Oh! Wait a minute! I'm thinking that for the end of days, Jack has managed to escape, leaving Jackson all alone! Oh no! Wait a minute! Wait a minute! Feast your eyes! As Connor and Dominic are climbing together! Jack just abandoned Jackson in the middle of the goddamn ring! Oh no, this is all falling apart. The journal manager of Monday Night Raw has been knocked out by Dominic. Connor escaping. Dominic trying to escape, but Jackson is getting up there. Can he escape? Is it too late? Oh wait, he didn't know. I thought that was it. I thought that was it. It's Connor. It's the one now. Now oh, the source to escape that book Dominic in the corner, what do I escape? But Jackson is there! I thought that was, I think, well, I thought, I'm sorry, Jack may have screwed 
uh, Jackson over. And now he's trying to climb. But, oh no! Thor oh, slams his head right into the steel mesh. And again, down goes Jackson. Jackson has been taken out cold. And now Dominic trying to get a foot in. It's Charles again. Oh my god. And Jackson's back on his feet. And Dominic Dominic is trying to climb out of the steel cage. And there's a right hand from Jackson trying to get out of there. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh no, wait. No, 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 no. Wait. Down. There's Jackson again. But can he get over? Jackson coming back up. Coming back up. It's time. It's time in it. Jackson now. Trying to stop Dominic from climbing over. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Don't do it. Oh, this this brought it back in. He's brought it back in. And Connor cheering him up. And now it's like Jackson trying to climb. It's, oh no. Oh, back and forth we go. Now wait a minute. He's reversed it. Jackson's reversed it. Down goes Dominic. I lost his footing on that a little bit. Hit now Jackson for a climb. Back and forth we go. Once again, but Dominic is back up on his feet. He's back up on his feet as he's gone back and forth. But Dominic spotting Jackson is like, no you don't son. No you don't. Oh my, oh my goodness. Oh my god, got money. Yeah, like 15 feet in the air. Jackson, you are a fool. I didn't tell you that much. But hey, he's the general manager. He can put himself in matches and put himself in big matches. Although the last time we had a steel cage match, that Jackson was in the Hell of Cell match between him and Titus O'Neil. And Titus O'Neil became the new United States champion. But looks like Dominic has got himself over. And so has Jackson now. They're both on top of the goddamn steel cage. Oh, face first. Face first. Oh no, wait, wait, wait. Oh my god. Whoa, 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 whoa. Easy now, boys. Easy. Oh, he's been busted wide open. Off the top of the goddamn steel cage. And all Dominic has to do is escape. Oh my god. The brutality. The brutality in this match. And Dominic may have just finished this. Is he going to escape? Jackson's getting back up. He doesn't realize that Dominic has won the match for him. And Connor, yes he has. What a match. Ladies and gentlemen, the longest still came to match in my universe. Here are your winners. It's busted open and all. Dominic Dominic And Connor picking up the win here. And that still cage match as Jackson crawls his way back to the commentary table. Dude, you Russian, I gotta awesome. give it to Dominic. He put up a fight, man. I gotta give it to Dominic. Yeah, but here's my question. What the hell was with Jack and abandoning you in the middle of that match? He wasn't abandoning me. He was trying to get out first to get the advantage for our team. Yeah, but I don't think so. He ran off after that. Did you, I mean, did I, you... That was our plan. Are you sure? Because yeah. I, I don't I don't know. I'm pretty sure that maybe Jack doesn't want to be part of this anymore. Oh, you're just trying to get into my head. Mm, oh well, we shall see. Uh, come Clash of Champions. When you two face off uh, Clash of Champions for the United the, U, the US and the Commonwealth Championship uh, undisputed title. And, well, you have made a very big match for Up Next, Daniel. But Up Next, ladies and gentlemen, an Extreme Rules matchup. Keith Lee versus Isaiah Swerve Scott. That match is next. Well, Jackson, welcome back after that huge steel cage match. And I am loving this show so far. Um, despite the fact that you put yourself in the match, Keith Lee versus Isaiah Swerve Scott, 
extreme rules. These two are gonna beat the living shit out of each other. And uh, the reason I made this match is because Keith Lee requested it, ask and you shall receive. That's what I'm gonna go by. But hey, an extreme rules match is an extreme rules match. Yes, Keith Lee came back and he said, hey, I need to wait for Smile off his face, he's putting on my nerves. Me and him, I'm more extreme rules match and I said, hey, it gives me another match to put on the card. I'm okay with it. Why the hell am I? Of course, so, the you. limit, so the limitless Keith Lee goes to Isaiah's Swift Scott is up next. Yeah, and of course, you know, Isaiah Swift Scott and his tag team partner over on CWA and on your show, I believe, with of MSK alongside his tag team partner. And here, here, what? Yes, no. Yes. And his opponent, Rick Swann, the MSK. MSK from Tacoma, recently. Washington, weighing in at 201 pounds, Isaiah Swerve Scott. Oh. Yes, Isaiah Swerve Scott is also a part of MSK alongside Wesley. Uh, uh um, CWA and of course your show, your show on Monday Night Raw. But I'm pretty sure that Wesley's going to be watching. Yeah, and uh, we've seen the streamers in that place. We know what it's like. These two are going to be the loving part of each other. Okay, I mean, I should uh, you just try to get the one over there. Um, and listen. I've never been in extreme rules matches, but I've been in major matches such as Yelsky, Hellenist Carol, Steel Cage, but I've never seen, I've never been in an actual extreme rules match, and now these two have incredible efforts, they're gonna go one on one in an actual extreme rules match right here. What a combination, followed up by a mic, a moonsault by Isaiah Swift Scott, taking the big man down. Yes, and then our next match will be our main event, 3 on 2 Handicap. Indeed, the three oh, and now it's Warb! Oh, what a super Warb. kick! Warb right. actually getting one over on Keith Lee. Yeah, I, would, I was thinking it would be the opposite way around. Because Keith Lee, he a big dude. He is! Dang, <laughs> I, they, they really must have big Keith backstage, my god almighty. I just received word from Triple H, the CEO of WWE, that, well, after Class of Champions, he wants to speak to all the general managers. Why? Because he's got a big announcement to make, and he wants you guys to pick uh, well, certain people for something. I don't know what it's got planned, but... He wants you guys to pick something. Oh no! Damn, what a maneuver by Swerve Scott. Wait a minute. Here we go. There's the jump. Oh Would well, that be the win already? No Let way. Me. One, two, That's it. Shit. That's it. Swerve Scott just beat the limit. Fuck that. He didn't even have Keep to use the weapon. Oh, maybe you can even have to use the weapon! Yeah. This match was like one minute! He didn't even need a weapon to defeat King Flea! He is the weapon! He is dude, this man's goaded! If this was an extreme rules match, he won in under a minute or something like that without even using a weapon. Maybe Isaiah Storm Scott is the limitless one. I would like to agree with you there. I'll uh, tell you what, this match may not have been extreme, but I can guarantee you what, what match will be extreme. And the TLC match between The Rock and, and King Edge. Uh, Clash of Champions for the Undisputed Universal Heavyweight Championship. 
where the Rock defends the WWE Championship, Edge defends the Universal Championship, uh, at Clash of Champions, but tonight, the Rock is teaming up with Titus O'Neil because he demanded to be in the match, and well, he, you said, hey, you got it, you hit him with the end of days, he got up, he hit you with a rock bottom, started celebrating, you beat the shit out of a referee for whatever reason, oh, hell broke loose, so tonight, the main event, next up, we got the, it's the three on two, handicap match, The Rock and Titus O'Neil versus The Judgment Day, oh man, go ahead and say it, Jackson. That match is next. Well, this is our main event 2 on 3 handicap match. The WWE Champion, The Rock, and Titus O'Neil coming up in Judgment Day, as you saw last week in the competition of Man and Joey It was supposed to be 1 on 3 handicap. Titus O'Neil first time to take down the Judgment Day because Titus O'Neil did everything he could to try to screw me out of my US title, but failed to the only cap he beat me because I fell through this cell. And then I took his game spot, and now I want to finish his career by putting him in a 3 on 1. But The Rock came out and said I demand a three on two, and I, I, I guess I was forced to add him to the match. Well, The Rock can do whatever he wants. He's the WWE Champion over on SmackDown. Of course, technically, ever since he fired Titus O'Neil from Monday Night Raw, Shane McMahon of the Jungle Manager of SmackDown, he paid attention to that SmackDown. He got one of the moments and hey, they're all mine. And, well, Brian Kendrick corrected Shane McMahon and said, hey, Tommaso Ciampa is staying exactly where he is because you said that you wanted to, or you wanted to really make Tommaso Ciampa's life a living hell over on Monday Night Raw. Because he wants the number one draft pick from the Monday Night Raw. Yeah, and look what I did. I, I made him go through hell. I took his US title on the 300th episode, and at one of them, I, I, I retired Johnny Gargano and Tommaso Ciampa from Monday Night Raw because in a rattle match against them too, I defended my title and it was a title versus career. If I won, I can't use title and they were fired from the press. Either one of them won, they just became US champion. And look, I unhooked the title, and now they're both gone from the Tomasa Chanka uh, uh, stayed on Rock as you said that to me, how uh, not text, but he said, actually, what you actually said to uh, uh, the Brian Kendrick on message to say, actually, I want to keep Tomasa Chanka on Raw because I want to make his life a living in hell. But also, Shane Sh Sh McMahon has. Uh, now he's only got Johnny Gargano still. But listen, Tomasa Chanka. I, he got karma to me because he got his karma, I called him out, he was supposed to have US title match on Raw, he attacked me from behind, I attacked him backstage, I took his title, and I retired him, he's still on Raw, but I'm gonna leave him alone because I think I already put him to the hell he deserved, Titus O'Neil, I kicked his ass in the hell in a cell, somehow I fell through when I wasn't paying attention, he pinned me, and he won the US title, but I took my US title back. And I took his game spot, and now he's gonna go through hell by facing the Judgment Day. Uh, but now I'm I, I'm worried because <coughs> of the rocking on the side. I hate to break your news to you, but that was only because of a little uncle uh, uncle howdy. And oh wait a minute, Edge is uh, looking a little bit different here. So, oh, uh, uh, boy got a haircut. He looking fresh over there. He is. A combined weight of 701 pounds. 701 pounds. Cesaro, Shinsuke Nakamura, and the rated R superstar, Edge. Uh, there you go, Edge. And yes, the reason I won back the United States title that I should never lost in the first place and I became general manager was because someone before the show could even start attacked Titus O'Neil from behind, which I have no idea who that is. I have no. I, I don't want anything to do with that person whatsoever, but that doesn't matter because I'm the new Raw General Manager and I'm the United States Champion, and when it comes to Clash of Champions, I'm going to beat Jack, I'm going to kick his ass, and I'm going to become the new Unified Intercontinental United States Champion, and then I'm going to go to CWA Warzone and become the FASW, FASW World Champion. Warzone. 
Sorry, I don't know why I keep saying CWA. My, this has been a crazy night, but I'm going to go to FAFW Warzone and become the world champion. So I'm be holding two belts. Indeed, you will be, but we shall see. But well, that's a different universe. <laughs> There's a Russian next week, man, to Cesaro here. I have oh, to come say on, yes. Of course, The Rock's going to start off this match because they want to get the win. Talisonia wants to keep this match like a little bit. <laughs> But Cesaro, he picked up a victory uh, not too long ago. I think it was against Stone Cold Steve Austin, I believe. Uh, no, was it against Stone Cold Steve Austin? I think, I think so. it was. Yeah, yeah, so he had to admit that, you know, you would thought that he would go very lightly. He was a nice shoulder break on what? But as you said, when it comes to Clash of Champions, just The Rock and Edge will go to Clash of Champions in the first match. For the WWE title and the Universal title to crown the first ever undisputed Universal Champion, I will be in a unification match. The same this will be in a unification match. Goldberg and Titus O'Neil will be in a unification match. But Excuse me, Ted DiBiase, you mean? Ted DiBiase, sorry, who did I say? You said Titus O'Neil. He's because he's in the match. I think you're oh, confused. Yeah, I'm, it's going to be crazy there. Anyway, little elbow drop by Titus O'Neil. Ted DiBiase and Goldberg will be in a unification match. Shane McMahon vs. Connor with the SmackDown against Carl Moore and the Crazy. But uh, right now, this is Monday Night Raw and the Judgment Day vs. Patasonia and uh, WWE Champion. And now, finally, Tony Raw has what's coming to getting a big ass deal. Wow, you got the King of Swing, the, the Swiss Superman is absolutely going crazy in the corner. And normally, he would wrestle in the suit, but he can't be in the suit anymore because I'm the general manager, so I'm the guy in the suit now. That is true. I might have to get a new one, a nice little suit made up. Yes, Cesaro, get in. <laughs> I feel like you need to get a little bit more unbiased than... Give him what he deserves. <laughs> Come on. He screwed me over. He screwed you guys over. Come on. You got this. Oh, time to sit in with a nice uh, uh, dragon screw and onto the pin. Uh, almost a one, uh, there's only a one count for Titus O'Neil. you are gonna admit, though, so, despite what you may think of Titus O'Neil, a former tag team champion of my universe mode, a former United States champion, former world general manager, he has done it all. He's also the ambassador. And oh my god, we're gonna preview, ladies and gentlemen, the rock and edge. Tonight. A preview of what we could get Clash of Champions, you say, you say, has no, I'm a two-time United States Champion, I'm the current World General Manager, yes, but I'll still me on the US title, I'll go to the general to eat, and I've done it for two weeks, which means I'm better than him, and yes, he's a practice champion, I'm going to become the undisputed Intercontinental United States Champion, and then I'm going to come to FAFW. And oh my god, uh, Snake Eyes right in the corner, and here comes Shinsei Nakamura. Nakamura. Come on, tag in Titus O'Neil. I want Titus O'Neil. There's Titus O'Neil, that's Nakamura. It's going right up to Titus, but Titus, oh, reversal, and Nakamura. The king of strong style. You've got, I mean, speaking of king, he was a king in a ring until Edge took the crown off of him. Yeah. And they're having back and forth matches for the crown and the universal cut on the line. So, today's going to be its time judge from the judgment day on the Cesaro. Oh, man. Now, speaking of Cesaro, he's back in this match in a massive loop of pedestal meal. I want Judgment Day make sure he can't walk after this match. Uh, I'm pretty sure they heard you. Wait a minute. Uh oh. The UFO incoming! Ha <laughs> ha oh, ha! That's what I'm talking about! You are That's what I'm talking about! One, two, a Titus O'Neil kicks out at two! Edge is pissed! He got him that Excuse ring. me? Only a two and now yeah. wait a minute! I'm with that neutralizer! Neutralizer! Tomorrow! Connects! The neutralizer! 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 
He's you know what? Beating. I think everyone needs to be more like Kozara. Who hasn't had to be more like Kozara. Uh oh, what the hell is Kozara doing? Look out, and an elbow to the back! Oh my god. <laughs> and again, a knee to the lower back. That's the kidney area. Oh, they are about to know. Uh, WWE in trouble here. One, two, oh no! The Rock is there. A game. Now, getting rid of The Rock. Out goes The Rock. And now Edge taking care of this. Uh, Titus I want to know how Titus O'Neil keep picking out. Because he's got a lot of heart, my friend. A lot of heart. And I I think Brad did have someone like this horror who actually oh, right does to my order. Right I'm starting the live button. I'm starting the live button there because I told this horror to punish him and look what he did. He hit him with the UFO and then neutralized with us. Glad to have someone who can listen and meet the one. Titus O'Neil got nobody to tag, and there's an armbar, but Shinsuke Nakamura, and Titus O'Neil, oh, a hot shot, running to the top rope, and there's an aim the leg now, it's now a 3 on 1, now the Rock has been taken out, there's Nakamura back in the position, going for him, another, wait a minute, and a, oh, a rack bomb, he wants to go swinging, Jackson, uh oh, and oh, wait for the double stops, Titus O'Neil with a reversal! And... Snap yes. Suplex! Yes. 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 Man. Tag made! Here comes The Rock! And The Rock is back in this! And a... Spiring Buster! Come on Rock! No! Buster! God damn it! No! no. This could be it! That's no. it! Oh no! Nakamura's there! Another Rock! Wait a SmackDown! Sinsuke Nakamura! Wait a minute, and... There goes Sinsuke! Oh no, he puts the brakes on! Oh man. Oh man, oh man. Titus O'Neil makes the tag! Here he comes again! Come on, Titus! Uh oh! Signature Titus O'Neil here! Forward slam! By Titus O'Neil, the power of Titus O'Neil Jackson! I'm getting worried. Judgment Day, this wasn't the plan. This wasn't what we talked about. This ends with the save. Oh, Edge is taken out. There goes Edge. Rock takes him out. And now Titus. Going for a power bomb, perhaps so. Reverse. Roll up. Reverse. Roll up. Roll up. One, two. Oh, kick out the heart. And now the Rock takes out Edge. Oh, back suplex on the outside. Oh my god, almighty. Oh my god, I'm lighting! Gone is an attack of the leg! Turn again! My is looking pissed. I think the rock has been taken out on the outside. Turn it nil. Not happy. Who that one has just been beaten and back and bruised by the judgment day. I know. In a minute. Oof! Into the corner. Boom, that's a chop right to the what's this the midsection. And again, this that's the kick. The man followed up by a knee. And Jackson, your plan seems to be working. Yes. It's glad to have some more good judgment day on wall who can actually listen to orders. As my plan seems to be working, Tadis oh, I mean the judgment day. Hopefully getting one over oh, on judgment day. Gutbuster, full of vanilla as a Cesaro with the counter. Can he make the tag to the rock? Can he make the tag? Can he make the tag? Yes! Here comes the rock! The rock now! Oh, wait a minute! Oh, there goes Cesaro! Cesaro! Cesaro, you dumbass! He's like, oh no! Wait a minute, and drop kick! There goes Cesaro! You dumbass, Cesaro! Cesaro, you dumbass! Stone Hosty of Austin and Randy Orton, they were successful against the Justin Day last week, but Randy Orton RKO'd them both, but then he got put through to the table for his troubles. 
So, okay. By the count of six, and the double goes back right. in the ring. Oh, oh, wait a minute! Neutralizer yeah. coming! And neutralizer! Neutralizer! Oh, this one is over! It's gonna be over! When it Titus, Titus is there! Ah! Titus O'Neil breaking up the pin. Only a one count. Uh oh, wait a minute. Come for a power bomb. Uh oh, no, 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 no. Power bomb to the outside! You are got to be kidding me. And here what? comes Shin. Let's freaking go. Uh oh, Shin's gonna knock oh, the The Shin kick. Oh, Shin kicks. The Japanese strong style of Shinsuke Nakamura. Where? That is going to be over. Ten. That's good for the second day. Got that. One, two, <laughs> and it kicks out. Oh my oh, god. Look at this. Titus O'Neil gets for the Cesaro. But Shinsuke Nakamura. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Rock bottom onto Shinsuke. Rock bottom onto Shinsuke. And now middle of the goddamn ring, and now he pulls him in to the middle of the ring. That's smart. That is smart. Away from the entire of Judgment Day. Away from the Judgment Day. One, two, no! Shinsuke kicks out. Um, that was a, to be fair, Judgment Day. <laughs> judgment Day. How do I admit he wasted a lot of time there? Spine to the pine. Spine Buster! Spine Buster! And now the most electrifying move in all of entertainment, Jackson! Here we go! Here it comes! People's Elbow! That's it! That's it! One! Two! Orange is there! Oh my god! He saves the matchup for the Judgment Day and there goes him! Let's go! Let's oh go. my god! Oh my god, what a man of that! Jackson, I'm gonna have to give me credit where credit is due. And Nakamura makes the tag to Cesaro. Who the heck believe about him on a rock? Uh, tag me, and here comes Titus. What? Yes, Why? Oh, the clothesline by Cesaro. Cesaro. Titus Amira is not getting the pain he deserves. Going for it again! This must be like the third or fourth neutralizer in the match! Oh, this is it. It's gotta be over now. Gotta be! Judgment what? Day! No! Rock saves it again! But Rock in danger here! Oh, oh wait a minute! What? Rock escapes! I'm in for the clothesline, but he ducks! Oh, clothesline on top of Rock! Oh my god, I know, look at Cesaro! Going it up high! No, wait a minute, what's he gonna do here? Oh no, he got, he got down, smart thinking. Smart thinking, oh, 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 Of course, Edge is the one to finish this. Of course, Edge is the one to finish this. Sending a message to The Rock, Jackson. Oh, wait a minute, counter! Oh, STO! Oh, wait a minute, Titus. Titus O'Neil, what's he gonna do? He's yes! Yes! Taking the rock! Yes! No! 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 The no. rock on the close line! Up to Edge! Send him a goddamn message! This is what's gonna no. happen for Clash of Champions! This is what's gonna happen at Clash of Champions, damn it! Oh no, wait a minute. Oh no, I didn't want to count Edge kicked out. You have to do more than that. We're just looking for it. Just looking for it. Went for the maybe the rock bottom. No. Count it. Into the into the corner now. Another rock. Ooh, Mitch is in trouble here. What a main event. I have to agree with you. you I'm I'm loving the fact that you're the general manager. Ooh, Doing way better than Titan. And oh me misses the SmackDown punch. Oh. Dinosaur suplex. <laughs> I'm tired. I'm, I'm sick of this. Titus O'Neil's not getting the pain inflicted on him that he deserves. Come on, Judgment Day. Get back. Get your head in the game. Otherwise, I'm going to have to do it myself. <laughs> well, I'm I mean, being serious. I mean, you went through hell and I still came from that earlier. And I'm pretty sure you need to keep your cool as the rock is 10 Who said I'm talking about tonight? 
is teeing off. I said that if Judgment Day doesn't get the win, I'm gonna have to take the title to by it myself. I never said tonight. <laughs> okay. Let's see about that. Uh oh, Titus O'Neil aiming for the arm. Titus O'Neil is he's on fire here. He's got Edge in trouble. Oh man. Right hand. No. Uh oh. Watch out now. Oh, that was a huge slam. And then the rock tags in. Uh oh, and then the rock. Uh oh. Uh oh, the rock. It's a bit far away from the. Uh -oh. Okay, running into him. Didn't mean to do that, and the. Uh... DDT! Who the hell is gonna win this? I have no idea. I hit a DDT! No. Come on, two, come on. Okay. Two! Oh, and he gets out again! Oh, they hit a huge DDT! But the rock gets rid of Shinsuke Nakamura! That's an atomic drop! And another one! Oh no! Edge from behind though! The distraction! They are coming! Slam slam! Ground slam! Billy Edge! Now Edge just taking his sweet, sweet time. Ah, oh, come on, I knew it! The coward! Taking in Cesaro! Oh wait a Oh no! Wait a minute! It's UFO! UFO! Wham! Next. Yes. This could Get be the it. win of Good Night for one day. Two. No! He kicks out again! The I Rock said is yes. I oh. said it. I'm sick of it. Oh no! Go for a shot shooter! Move break though! It's move break! Too close to the ropes! And they're giving our titles to new! From behind! From behind! <laughs> From behind. <laughs> oh hell! That is broken loose! I am sick of this. I am sick of this bullshit. You know what? After this match, Tato Sumio on SmackDown, I want you oh, wait a and minute, then wait I a minute, quit that. Wait a minute here. One, two, two. and he kicks out again. The you know what? Give me, give me an actual microphone. I have an announcement. I have an announcement. So be quiet, Daniel. Tato Sumio on SmackDown after this match. I want oh, you God. and then I quit match. And I quit match on SmackDown? I don't know if he's going to be able to, to a, a submission iron quit match, I believe. Oh man, a rocket edge in the middle of the ring. I want Titus Bonnie off in an I quit match. Oh my god. But I'm smacked down. I'm done with this. And no, I'm not putting my US title on the line. I need to keep this, pre this precious baby. Oh my god, that was huge news in the middle of them. God damn match. And, oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. This wasn't the plan! Oh, 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 oh. Then Nakamura is there! Wait a minute! Wait a minute! Wait a minute! Wait! 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 Oh, he Nakamura saves him! He saves him! That bastard! No, he's he's been here for 20 minutes! Oh my God! A huge super kick! A huge super he's kick! Been here for 20 minutes! To oh, no! I don't believe this! Titus O'Neil is there, and Edge is giving so up. Big. You son of a bitch! Watch out, watch out! Oh, it was a match of the lights! Edge now, wait a minute! DDT by Edge! DDT by Edge! Kick to the mid section! You son of a bitch! Oh, back in it again! Uh oh. Now Nakamura makes the tag! Uh oh, no, wait a minute, what's Nakamura gonna do here? He's gonna pick up the scraps! He's gonna pick up the scraps! You kidding me? No! Oh no, wait a minute! He is! He's gonna do it! Do no, he went to the house! He missed it! He hit the. And. Uh, Russell makes me. The Russell! He has been Russell. here for 20 minutes! Oh my god, one! Oh, they have one count, and Nakamura does not quit! Nakamura does not quit! Tank made to Tyler's of Mill! Oh my god! Uh oh, wait a minute, the more now. Looking for a German suplex, Titus and Neil, and a counter. Oh, and chucks him across the ring. Double added chokes now, and now he's getting pumped up. And now, oh no, submission maneuver. Rope break, Jackson, rope break. Keep the cool, buddy, keep the cool. I am sick of it. Oh, we have been here for 20 minutes. 
<laughs> it's almost like you've been timing this. <laughs> I haven't. I'm just estimating a guessing. Oh, now the rock is going crazy here. Lance of Shinsuke Nakamura. And now we're going to see it again. The most electrified move in sports entertainment today. It took a piece of rubber pad and... Uh, people's go! Nakamura! Wait a minute! Counter! And rock bottom! Rock bottom! Rock bottom! This is going to be it! This is going to be it! One! No! Cesaro there! And now a spine buster to Cesaro! He does not care who it is! He's taking out everybody! He's taking out everybody! Another rock again! Oh, Nakamura with a counter! Oh my god! Oh my god, I can barely believe it! I don't believe this! Oh my god, both with a rock! I'm sick of this! <laughs> oh man! What a match! And now they're thrown in the outside! I'll get away from that table, damn it! <laughs> oh my god, Jackson, I can't believe this! I'm sick of this. I'll take a count out victory if we can. <laughs> this match is going to end. Oh, he's right in front of you! Oh my god! Oh, right in front of that table! Titus O'Neil! Titus O'Neil! Titus O'Neil, I'm gonna see you on SmackDown in that submission I quit match. Oh, that submission I quit match and. Four-way slam on the outside! Oh my god, I don't know who is going to win here. Judgment Day, or The Rock and Titus O'Neil. This, this match would have ended 30 minutes ago if The Rock wasn't with Titus O'Neil. Oh, look at the power! Uh-oh, referee up to set them! I don't think, I don't think Titus cares! Eight. Nine! Nine! Oh no! It's gonna be a counter! Serious? It's gonna be a counter! It's gonna be... Oh no, yes! He just about... No! He got in the ring! He got in the ring! He got in the ring! What the fuck? No! I call power! I call it you! 2.5 seconds! Unbelievable! He was literally 2.5 seconds away from getting in the ring before the 10 count. But it is the 10 count. It was a count of... No, victory. you know what? No, Katasomiel, I want to talk to you backstage. We're not over with the show. Oh, for God's sake. So you think it's funny to get count of victories on my show, Katasomiel? No, absolutely not. And no resisting. Get over there. You cheated in that win on my show. I better see you on SmackDown in that I Quit match. No Judgment Day, no Rock, no US title. Just me and you. Get down, you son of a bitch. That's what I thought. I can't believe that Jackson is doing this to Titus O'Neil. I can't believe this whatsoever. That I got, oh my god, for a goddamn table. Got That's what you me. get, kid. Oh, Welcome god. back to the big leagues, bitch. Oh, god, a chance shot. A goddamn chance shot. No, 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 no. What the hell, man? This is what pain feels like. Oh my god, he's not even gonna make it to SmackDown. God almighty. Oh my god, that seriously. Gotta stop this, Jackson. You really gotta stop this. Come on, man. Oh no! Wait a minute. What are you thinking? What Come on, Ty. Just stay down. Oh no! Wait a minute. Don't even think about it, Jackson. This is not the time. Not the place. My God! Strong man. Oh man! Oh no 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 no! Under days! You bastard! How dare you do the other days? Oh my goodness! Get this gracious! What? Are you? 
No! You sick bastard! What are you thinking, man? What are you thinking? My name is Titus. Titus is following Jackson here. Oh no, no, wait. They're not even gonna make it. So, don't yes. Titus! Yes, he's taking the bait. <laughs> oh no, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. No, oh, no, no, no! Out from my up there! Don't you even dare. Don't even dare. Oh my god. No, 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 no! Oh my god! Jackson, I don't think Titus O'Neill is gonna make it to this I quit, man. Oh no! Oh no. No. No, wait, wait a damn second. Get up, buddy! Get up, buddy! Oh no, this no, is what no, no! 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 You're gonna be kidding me! He's out. He's out. There's no way. Oh my <sighs> god, oh my god, oh my god almighty. What a Monday Night Raw, Jackson is a freaking maniac. We need some paramedics down here, damn it! Paramedics! I don't know, I don't know if Tonus O'Neill's gonna make it to the I quit match. I don't know! Well, oh, that's all we've got time for, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Dan, our 2 times 15 on Xbox Live, Dan on YouTube. Until next time for more WWE Universe Mode, we'll see you on SmackDown. And it's a goodbye from me. And a goodbye from me. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you want to watch the previous video, click on the video on the left. But if you want to watch the playlist, then click on the video on the right. Also, feel free to click subscribe by clicking on the Master Chief icon on the top.